and today we are going to be reading Waiting is Not Easy by Mo Willems. And you know what? I agree with that. Waiting is not easy. And look here, that's Gerald on the cover. Do you think he likes waiting? I don't think so. He looks a little upset there. But in the story, he has to wait and he has to have patience because his friend Piggy has a surprise for him. What do you think? Do you think he's going to be able to wait and have patience for the surprise? <gasps> All right, let's find out and see. Waiting is not easy. Gerald. I have a surprise for you. <gasps> Yay. <gasps> what is it? The surprise is a surprise. Oh, is it big? Yes. Is it pretty? Yes. Can we share it? Yes. I cannot wait. You will have to. Wait. What? Why? The surprise is not here yet. So I'll have to wait for it? Yes. Groan! Oh well, if I have to wait, I will wait. I am waiting. Waiting is not easy. Piggy, I want to see your surprise now. I'm sorry, Gerald, but we must wait. Groan. I am done waiting. I do not think your surprise is worth all this waiting. I will not wait any more. Okay, I will wait some more. It will be worth it. Groan! Piggy! We have waited too long. It's getting dark. It's getting darker. Soon we will not be able to see each other. Soon we will not be able to see anything. We have wasted the whole day. Well, um... We have waited and waited and waited and waited. And for what? For that. Oh. This was worth the wait. I know. To borrow Morty? I want to show you the sunrise. I cannot wait. Wow. The end. He did it! He waited for the surprise and it was so beautiful. And you know what? I am very proud of Gerald because it is very hard to wait for things. And it's even harder to wait for things when it's something you're really, really excited for. What do you think? Is it hard to wait for things that you're very, very excited for? Yeah, I think so. But what teacher Ava likes to do when I have to wait for something, I like to distract myself so the time goes by a little faster. So today I'm going to help you make a waiting bottle. And you can use your waiting bottle if you have to wait for something at home or you can take it with you when you know you have to wait in a long line for something. It's a good way to distract yourself. 
All right, so what you're gonna need is a clear plastic bottle like this or like this, and then you're gonna need some oil, which is already in our bottle here, and some water, and then you're gonna need some things to go inside the bottle. You could use glitter or sand, or you can find other little things to go inside. I'm going to use this mix of beads. And then you're gonna need some food coloring and some tape and scissors. Now, what you're gonna do first is fill your bottle halfway with oil. Now see, my oil is already inside because luckily, this was coconut oil that was already expired, so I'm going to use it for our project today, and I'm so excited because Teacher Ava is recycling. Okay, so once you have it filled halfway with your oil, then you're going to put your things inside. So, like I said, I'm going to use some beads. So I'm going to put some in my hand and put them inside the bottle. Ooh, see, they're kind of floating down to the bottom already. Let's put them in. All right, maybe a few more. I want to see very beautiful. Okay, so once the, the beads are in the oil or your glitter or sand or whatever you have, then you're going to put food coloring. I'm going to put about six or seven drops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do ten. Eight, nine, ten. Okay. Got my food coloring in there. Now I'm going to fill up my water bottle the rest of the way with water. Ooh, things are already mixing up already. Okay, so once it's filled, you're going to put your lid on really tight. Ask your grown up to help you with this because it's really important to be really tight. And then you're going to take your bottle and you're going to shake it, 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 shake And then watch everything swirl around together. Now, when you're waiting, what you can do is shake it really good and then wait for the oil and the water and all the colors to separate. And then maybe your time will be up for waiting. All right? So. I am very excited to see what you find to put inside of your waiting bottle. And the next time you have to bring it along, next time you have to wait for something, and shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. All right, have fun. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.